I don't need it. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I need it. I want the world. Yeah, I want the world. Yeah, I want it all. Said I want the world. Yeah, I want the world. I'm coming to get it. Hey, so if you guys want to buy that cheap and reliable MT, make sure you hop over to NBA MT Zone and use code HTB for a 5% discount. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are back at the Evo screen, and I guess they just don't understand what I mean when I say the grind don't stop. No matter what Evo cards they throw at me, the grind don't stop. And as you can see in front of you today, it's going to be a special one, man. Today, I'm bringing you guys the very first auctionable pink diamond evo card in nba 2k20 my team as you can see we got it all done 2500 points 200 dunks 100 games played whatever you want to throw at me i'm gonna get it done so without further ado ladies and gentlemen let me introduce to you pink diamond xavier mcdaniel Man, oh man, is he looking beautiful, but hey, what's up guys, Henry the Blazian here, and welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be debuting none other than this 96 overall pink diamond Xavier McDaniel, and boy, does he look good as a pink diamond. As of right now, I believe I am the very first one with him. You guys know I'm always grinding my nuts off for you guys so I can get you guys content, especially when it comes to these Evo cards, the amount of nights I go without sleeping is absolutely ridiculous. I'm surprised I don't have like some kind of brain damage by now. Actually, I, I probably do. I, I probably definitely do. But anyways, that aside, I like to grind because I do this for you guys, man. So if you guys can go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already or leave a like on this video. Let's aim for at least 800 likes on today's video for this grind, man. That would be seriously appreciated. But yeah, man, we got the boy, Xavier McDaniel, the card everyone's been looking for forward to evoing other than the jerome kersey who i also did a gameplay on i claim that card to be the best card in my team today we're gonna find out if this xavier mcdaniel can take that throne man but uh yeah without further ado let's dive into these stats and then we'll hop into a game so again ignore the overalls when it comes to the evo cards but he's a 6'9 small forward and that's what really caught my attention because he could be someone who's annoying on offense but guard cards like Giannis on defense especially when Giannis has that crazy hop step you gotta have someone that can guard it but yeah 215 pounds and the biggest thing about him being a pink diamond is he gets a lot of new stats and badges and diving right into the stats you can see I already decked this man out he's here to stay you're not gonna find him on the auction house and if you do he isn't mine I think this card is gonna be so OP and diving right into it an 85 driving layup looking good 85 post fadeaway with the shoe originally it was an 82 so you love to see that upgrade as well but all I'm seeing are greens man especially when it comes to the shooting my boy's got a 92 mid-range and an 87 three-pointer slap a floor general and my coach boost on there and that's practically a 95 open three for our boy mcdaniel man i do have a three-point shoe on him which is what makes it an 87 originally it was an 84 84 free throw 95 driving dunk uh ball handling didn't really go up but i don't mind it at that rating the block is at an 83 a steal at an 81 the rebounding is also there which is always huge to have an extra big body that can rebound one of the biggest upgrades this man really got though was the speed 92 speed 89 acceleration and 82 speed with ball bro before that was a 69 like the upgrades on this card are really crazy 95 vertical as well 84 strength you definitely love to see his defense goes up a ton as well 88 pass perception 85 defensive consistency and 85 help defense so once again another huge dub for this card especially on paper as far as evil cards go the fact that you can get a card like this just by grinding the game out is absolutely insane but it's not just the attributes here that we're looking at we got to take a look at the badges as 
well. And he comes with now three Hall of Fame badges. Showtime, which is pretty cool. Cross Key Scorer, which is going to be great for going to the rim. And Pogo Stick, when you're trying to block people, should be huge. Other than that, I do wish he had like Hall of Fame Downhill or something. But I feel like that would make him too OP. He does come with 28 gold badges, though. I'll name the important ones, such as Pickpocket is really nice. Clamps, you love to see. Heart Crusher, Interceptor. He got a lot of those defensive badges when he became a pink diamond. Off Ball Pest as well. He does have the gold quick draw, which is what makes this card so, so good already. Now he's also got Tireless Defender, Trapper, Contact Finisher, but one badge I do want to see on this man is not just Downhill, but Green Machine as well, going along with Hot Start, Ice in the Veins, and then the one Silver Post Move Lockdown. So all around, man, this dude looks like he's going to be an absolute demigod as far as it looks on paper, but it's time to see if this man can really hoop when it comes to the unlimited streets. So without further ado, boys and girls, let's hop into a game and let's see what McDaniel is all about. Oh, man let's get into it all right and our matchups looking like sydney moncrief jr smith who's that at the three galaxy opal dominique so this is definitely going to be a tough matchup Giannis and galaxy opal david robinson oh my goodness mcdaniel is this going to be a debut wow all right boys and girls welcome to yet another htb gameplay hopefully we don't get flooded this game because honestly i've been playing like a bot since the game's been coming out since i've really just been playing offline get in the post there there we go hit him with a fadeaway to start it's not going down that's tough right to mcdaniel got him to the rim not putting it down and not scoring the layup that's not how we want to start the game bro this Giannis going to the rim is so annoying to guard he can run as many pick and rolls as he wants good defense oh come on we got to guard that a little better next time i'm seeing mcdaniel with the gold um downhill to the rim putting it down to start the game he's running a three-point play it's not working let's go to mcdaniel's in transition again putting it down baby let's go he runs down the court fast come at me come at me Giannis with that hop step that's not working today thank you I'll take that uh right to my boy now to McDaniels again all the way through putting it down oh my goodness uh let's see if I can actually get my boy open for a shot give me a nice little iso he is going to be reaching so just be aware for that oh he's not even really playing on ball defense you hate to see it hit that screen for me please now hop into it oh I tried to hop into it and he just wanted to dunk it this man's playing like Wilkins I see a pass in there. Uh, pump fake. Let's see who's going to get open. Oh, never mind. He's just jumping. Easy dunk. I thought someone else would come to help. I guess not. So far, we do have the lead, which is nice. I just wish he would play some kind of on-ball defense. McDaniel, get in there. Get in there. Now get in the post. Got him. Fade away real quick. Oh, that's going down. I really thought that was going to miss. Card is hooping right now. I'm trying to get him open for some shots, but this man's defense is crazy. Look at McDaniel on the defensive end. Pogo stick showing off right there. We're able to hop super quick. Let me see. Oh, he's fouling intentionally right away, and we got some free throws. On the fast break, every time this man messes up, he hits you with a personal foul. That's how you know someone is a sweater. But uh, McDaniels, you are off to a pretty good start. I hope we can get some open shots here for you, though. Dominique playing good defense, but not good enough. We're into the second quarter here. Oh, I really wanted to steal that and make something happen. Great defense there by Isaiah Thomas, bro. Let's go right to McDaniels. Blow by this man. Oh, never mind. We're not blowing by. We got our boy Stouty, though. Pump fake. Oh, I'm open. Easy dunk. Ooh, he's got the franchise in here. I see Eddie Jones there. Get there. Good contest. No way that should go down. Thank you. Now, let's get running. Don't worry. I see you, my guy. There we go. Blow by. Downhill. Do your thing. Thank you. He misses the second one there. There we go. Wait. Why did our opponent just leave the match? Oh, man. I mean, we were only up nine points. My boy was doing his thing against Opal Neek and Opal David Robinson protecting the rim. I really wanted to finish this game. Now, what's actually funny is I lagged out of two games right before this one. So that could have happened to this guy. Still pretty unfortunate, though. So we're going to have to go ahead and hop into another game, man. That's so tough. All right, on to game number two. This time it's going to be Amethyst Kenny Smith. I actually have not seen him. Uh, Kobe, Rudy Gay, Sean Kemp, and Magic Johnson at center. Not really the craziest lineup. I would have preferred to play the other team. But McDaniel, let's go back to doing our thing. All right, boys, game number two is underway. We're not here to play around. We know what this McDaniel can do, and I want to see it all blown by again. Dunking it to start the game, bro. Yeah, this man blows by like 2K19 Giannis. 
All right, man. Let's see what this Xavier can do. I need to get this man open for a jump shot. That is my goal for this game. We got to debut at least one three-pointer on this man. Snatch back. There it is. That's my chance. Green bean. You guys see how fast that jumper is? It's beautiful. I am all about the shooting barrage this game, man. Whatever gets my boy McDaniel open, I'm going for it. Catch and shoot again. Not a green, but it's a bucket, baby. Good defense there. Lock up. No way Rudy Gay is hitting that. Thank you. There we go. Now let's push the pace. McDaniel, I know you got that goal downhill. So hustle down the court and put it down on Rudy Gay. I'm not going to lie. That man running magic at center is actually pretty cancer. He's way too fast for Ewing. Oh, you are cutting. Go through with it next time. That's a bad shot. I don't know how that's dropping. It was supposed to be a dunk. This guy's actually playing pretty good. Him running his offense through Magic Johnson has honestly been a little bit tough. Snatch back. Oh, to the rim. Dunk on him. Oh, baby. Let's see. Where are we going? Oh, this man is reaching. Got to be watching out for that. And snatch back. Oh, I'm blown by. I'm hopping into it. Easy and one. Oh, give me those. You can see when he's not up against Dominique Wilkins, this card is looking unstoppable right now. Whether it's shooting, going to the rim, running down the court, he is crazy. This man using Magic Johnson for his offense, though, is genius. Because it's really hard to stop him with Patrick Ewing here, man. Lock up. Lock up. Lock up. You can try to blow by me all you want. That's called getting clamped up. This right here, I call getting clamped up. AF! No way that goes down. Thank you. Now let's push the pace. I know my man's got takeover, so let me snatch back. Mr. Downhill all the way through. A! Give me a nice little ISO here to start the second quarter. Cross up. That's a nice little blow by again. Hop into it. Oh, there we go. Got them all. Give me those. And one again! Xavier McDaniel, bro. This card is doing it all. Convert that. Thank you, bro. That free throw is easy, too. All right, McDaniel, I want to see how much more of a sniper you are, so you know what I got to do here. Hit him with that off-ball deodorant, catch, and shoot, not a green, but it's a bucket for the mans. No way. Bro, that Magic Johnson is greening threes. Am I missing something? I thought that card had like a 65-3. What is going on right now? Behind the back. Oh, Xavier. Oh. But on a serious note, why is that card hitting so many threes? That Magic Johnson has hit three threes on me now. Unforgivable. Oh, that's an easy pass. Next time, make it go through, please. Nice little blow by, though. Hop and easy dunk once again. Yeah, this man plays like a Giannis on offense. Let's see. Where are we going here? Oh, he's reaching. You know who's going to be open. Catch. Pump fake. Oh, we got him. The Stouty. Dimer me, mama. Green bean. I see my boy open there. Jason Richardson. I don't know why he had to step all the way out there. Give me that off dribble. Nope, we're missing it. Got the board, though. All right, let's be careful. I just realized it's actually a one-point game. He should have stolen that, to be honest. Uh, pick and roll, though. To the rim. Nah. Oh, we're drawing a foul. I'll take the bailout. Overall, though, McDaniel, bro, this card is playing amazing so far. Gotta love what he's doing. Jay Rich, let's convert these two free throws and let's keep doing our thing. I can't stand when people zigzag like crazy on pick and rolls. I'm still here. Ibaka, thank you. They call him Ibaka. Now let's go to my boy McDaniel all the way through. Hop, got him. Easy layup and one again. What is that? His third and one now? That's crazy. Card is really out here doing his thing. He's definitely going to be good for going up against cards like Giannis. I really like his height, man. McDaniel, let me try throwing you an alley-oop, see what you're all about. Come hit this screen, please. Thank you. Oh, he's already rolling a little early. Oh, that dunk was supposed to be ours, but he got the defensive three seconds. I mean, I'll take a free point, but oh my goodness, I miss it. Yikes. How do you miss a 95 free throw, HDB? Come on. Nice pass there. Nice dunk to start the second half. That's how we wanted to start it. J.R. Smith, I forgot how this card is still in the game. That's a good closeout there for the most part. Don't know how that was only a yellow, but uh, J. Rich to the downhill demigod himself. Blow by to the rim. Don't know what kind of shot that was. I'm going to take it, though. Let's go into a nice little pick and roll. Come hit the screen. There we go. Right around the screen. No? Okay, we'll go through instead. I don't know what kind of blow by that was. I'm going to take it, though. Weber Green Bean. I had no idea Robert Parrish was able to play the four. He's got Robert Parrish and DeAndre Jordan on the court right now, which means he's going to be getting a ton of rebounds. Get that rebound, please. All right, there we go. Let's get back to running. The downhill demigod himself. Hop into it. Put it down, baby. All right, I want to go back to showing off McDaniels 3 a little bit more here. Hit that screen. Oh, yeah. Off-ball deodorant. Oh, it's not working today. I'm going to hop into it once again. Giannis style. I didn't even need to hop there. Blow by. Snatch back. Give me those, please. Bang! Oh my lord! 
All right, Xavier, you've been shooting a lot of threes, and I want to see some more of them. So uh, let's run that back real quick. Hit that screen. Go get open somehow. Go get open. There it is. Catch. Pump fake. Oh, he bit it. Where is it right there? Dimer me, mama. Thank you. Oh, that's going down. Hezo and cross up. Snatch back. Are we shooting it? Nope. You got him. Off the dribble. Why not let him fly? <laughs> oh, my goodness, McDaniel. All right, just finished abusing the life out of timeouts. Thank God I didn't, like, glitch out. I forgot that glitch is still out there, so calling a timeout is always a risk. But I want to try to get a nice little alley-oop here to end this quarter off. Pick and roll for me. Hey! The pick and roll is honestly a bit difficult to guard when it's played right. Right there, we contest it correctly. Nice rebound. The man with a downhill is already down the court to the rim, putting it down. Well, I just realized that we're up damn near 30 points. I feel like this was a close game earlier on, but we just kind of took the lead here. Go get open, my guy. Oh, my God. What kind of spread offense is this? Pump fake inside. Is this going to work out somehow? Yes, it is. Okay. At this point, I'm basically just shot chucking. We got a minute left in this game. The, look at the settings they've got on McDaniel, bro. The tight defense that they play is actually crazy. Easy post hook there. Easy bucket. Every time someone plays tight defense, I'm cutting to the rim. Let's go there. Right back to my man. Oh, I'm pulling that. You're leaving me wide open. Say less. I'm sorry to be a savage. I had to do it to you. And as you guys can see, man, we go ahead and we win this game 72 to 48. So quite a blowout and quite a performance here from Xavier McDaniel, bro. Let's go ahead. Let's check out the box score and let's see how our boy did. All right, man. So as you guys can see, McDaniel with quite the performance today, man. In 20 minutes, the dude had 59 points, two rebounds, three assists, two turnovers, 24 for 35 from the field, five for nine from three, and six for seven from the free throw line. Now, what impresses me even more about this card was how easy it was to score. I'm not going to say I'm good at unlimited right now, because honestly, I don't think I'm that good at unlimited. I think I'm kind of offline made right now. I've been playing way too many bots that I kind of feel like a bot, but the fact that I was still able to perform like I did with this card makes me super, super happy. He feels like he was absolutely worth the grind. Usually the worst feeling is when you grind a card all the way to max evo and you know you're just not going to use it at all for example jerry stackhouse bob mcadoo but they were more kind of evolved just so i could get the jason richardson but uh yeah usually some people get evos and they realize how much time they wasted because a new card comes out that's better but cards like xavier mcdaniel and jerome kersey i feel like are cards that are going to be solidified on people's lineups for a while if you grind them out they will definitely make an impact on your lineup now some of you might be wondering as we get an update required right there is which card is really the best evo card in the game xavier mcdaniel or jerome kersey and when it really comes down to it you guys are going to be surprised but i'm actually going to go with jerome Kersey. In my opinion, that card is still just all around the best card in the game. He's able to speed boost. He's got the 86 ball handling. His rebounding is insane. He feels a little bit faster. Now, that's not to say this McDaniel is not worth the grind because he also absolutely is. But if you're asking which card is better, it's going to be Jerome Kersey. Which card are you better off grinding? It's probably Xavier McDaniel because his requirements are quite easier than Kersey's, man. But either way, both cards are demigods both of those cards are going to be on my lineup for a good minute and i'm gonna enjoy the life out of them starting now i'm probably gonna go to bed now because i've been up for quite a while grinding this card out so i can get you guys this gameplay and then i'm probably gonna work on my online game a little bit just so my gameplays can be a bit better for you guys i'm sure there's times where you guys are watching and you're like wow htb is a bot i don't want to be like that anymore i got to get a little bit better at this game but uh, with that being said this is going to be the end of the video so if you did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and for you new viewers you know you gotta hit that subscribe button and join the blazion nation man i want to thank you guys for watching i hope you all have an awesome day and take care